for many years the standard infantry fighting vehicle of the South African Army had been the Ratel. This 6x6 vehicle was developed almost 40 years ago and now is well overdue for replacement. It will now be replaced by this new vehicle called the Badger. The Badger is a further development of the uh, vehicle developed in Finland by Patria called the Armour Modular Vehicle. There are five versions of it and this particular one is the anti-tank guided missile version and it is armed with the Iguani laser guided missile. The turret, which is of modular design, has two missiles either side. One of them is actually just out the launcher box. The South African National Defence Force is taking delivery of 238 of these vehicles. The first 18 are coming from Patria and the rest will be made under licence in South Africa. But what makes it special is it's got a very advanced mine protection package. In addition to this version, there are other specialised versions. One is fitted with a turret armed with a 30mm cannon, another one is a command post version and yet another one is 60mm breech loaded mortar. The Badger, in the anti-tank guided weapons version, is fitted with a turret with four Iguani guided missiles. This particular one is called the Iguani Portable Launch System and it is designed for use in the field. It's fairly light and it carries one Iguani missile. What's important about this one, it is laser guided, which makes it more difficult to jam. This particular missile can be fitted with a number of warheads. This is a tandem high explosive anti-tank warhead, primary to ne neutralise tanks. This missile has a number of other applications and is, in addition to being selected by the uh, South African Army, is also selected by Malaysia. They are building a vehicle called the AV-8 and this will have a similar turret to the Badger, also armed with four Iguani in the ready-to-launch position.